have this one fall, though, right? No, we don't or want that one to fall. It's like, that's going to be like kind of. Probably needs to be closer to the booth and not. Yeah, uh, there's actually a damage. I'm using a damage piece of plywood. Okay, how did I miss that? Uh -huh. Okay, that makes a difference. It could so easily just turn into business or an activity, right? Because that's structurally, that's what it can be. It can also be, I don't know, like diving deep into the intention of it, but it's a human being giving something to another human being. Friend up, the, yeah, from then the get into this. If you're, if you're upstage at all, you're lost. Okay. I'm just spending my time. I'm just a happy roving cowboy. You ready? You ready? You ready? And then let him have it. Come and give it to Yes. Ever. Ever for any show you've ever done. So for the longest time I thought that the name of this uh, musical was uh, A Fiddler in the House. Because that that's how Ryan emailed me. He said, oh, we need this. We need a fiddler in the house, and I thought that was the name of the, <laughs> nice, of the show. Nice, so I kept nice. telling everybody, they're like, what show are you playing for? It's called A Fiddler in the House. Then finally I saw it outside that it was Chaps. I was like, what's Chaps? Am I playing for this thing called Chaps? <laughs> <laughs> How you enter defines your character, but also defines the pace that we're going to operate with the rest of the show. Uh, yeah. Put a pin in the bottom of the sides there, will you? 